It's just fired What's up guys, welcome back to the channel. Um, today we're gonna go over how we build wings. Um, design spill plates and things like that. So um, we're actually gonna be working on a 93 Mustang. So I've made a bunch of wings for these cars. So actually what I've got is I've got templates made that I've already made that we use for spill plates. And we use all kind of all about the same shape. You know, we can come through here and angle this different, make this roll a little bit longer, whatever. This is right here is what we use on our um, small tire type cars. Something's going to run 150, 160 mile an hour, you know, in the eighth. So this is our basic design um, of what I'm going to use. Actually, this is what I'm going to use today. But to get these designs, I take just a big sheet of cardboard and I get an idea of how I kind of want to look coming off the back of the cross quarter panel. So then, once I get that in my head, I just cut it smooth. You know, there's no lines on this thing right now. Um, and then once I get there, then I got to figure out where all the bends are on the body, so that way the car, um, that way the wing, you know, flows with the body lines. So as you see, this one has lines already on it. Well, it's because I use this. And then what I actually end up doing is I have a break. And I put my cardboard, this is pretty thick cardboard. So I put it in the brake and I bend all my places how they need to be bent on all my lines. So that way when I hold up to the car, I get the exact angles I need. Uh, like I said, this might be using a little bit, so I'll actually bend it back to the car, get exactly what I need. That way I know when I transfer it to my sheet of aluminum, what it needs to be. So um, I've already traced these out on the sheet of aluminum, which we just use some shears to cut it. So I'll show you how we got them traced, and then this is the actual wing part. So you see it's all taped together and stuff for us to use. And then on the spill plate, we can just flip it around for each side of the car. And then where my lines are, I just make my bends go the other direction so I know which spill plate is which. So we'll get the camera here and I'll show you how this is, how we got them traced to the piece of aluminum. So as you can see here, we have it traced, kind of a little glare. We have it traced onto the piece of aluminum. So now what I'm gonna do is I'll go through and I'll cut this all out and then we'll go over to the brake and I'll show you how we break those. So uh, let's cut this stuff out. All right, cutting this stuff out. I got a piece of tube in here so I can slide this under. So that way when my shears are out, I'm not cutting the table.
one bent. Let's go see how it looks up against the side of the car. All right, so if we put that kind of on the car, we see that we need to bend it just a little bit. Right down the middle. So we'll go back to the brake, bend this, then come back and see what it looks like. All right, so what I actually ended up doing was taking my leg right here, because this needs to be a little roll to roll right here. So I just took my leg and just pushed down on it some to give it a little roll. So when we line, let's see, like this right here, it's going to be something like that on the car. So we've got a body line here, this body line here that comes and meets this right here, and then this body line will run right up through here. So oh, as you can see there, right there. So this thing right here is ready, so we'll go through now, and we'll measure down through here to do the, uh, put some Clecos in it, and then we'll come put some Clecos right here, so we can get this thing ready to roll. All right guys, so we've got both spill plates made, both spill plates bent. So now what's left to do is like I said, we're gonna go through, put some holes in here, get some Clecos on the car, and uh, we'll see what these look like on the car. All right guys, so got the spill plate on, got a couple holes click out in here to hold it. So we're gonna go through now, drill these holes real quick, and then we'll put some more Clecos in. Got our Clico tool, so. All right, spill plate's on. So uh, now what we would do is, obviously this deck part's flat and then we'll build the wing struts. So this is kind of just a how-to on how we make spill plates. Like I said, we can make any different design if we want to cut them through here at a big angle or bring them out farther and roll them. Um, but this right here is what we do for, like I said, cars around 150, 160 mile an hour. That way, helps with a little bit of downforce and stuff, so. But, that's it guys, so. Thanks for watching. Make sure to like, subscribe, and comment some more stuff y'all want to see. We're gonna keep doing how-to videos. Thanks guys.